Hi, I'm Celeste and welcome to Find Your Purple. Today is day zero for what I'm calling my 21 days of transformation. Today, scientifically, it takes 21 days to build a habit. And so I'm going to use the next 21 days to put in some habits of things I want to change in my life. Now, you could focus on one habit or you can focus on multiple habits. I'm kind of doing several that um, I think I mentioned in an earlier video. I've done a chart, so I'll be doing exercising, which has really been a weak part for me in my life to be consistent with it. And now at my age, I know I have to be. I'll do some exercises with my facial muscles as well. I'm going to give that a shot. And I'll be doing some additional spiritual work. I'll be got my new Pilates chair that I'm going to start doing. So I've got quite a few things in different aspects of my life. Nothing huge, uh, just small habits I'm wanting to put in place. Kind of using that mind renewal for this next 21 days. Um, if you think about it, you have used it in your life in some capacity. I went vegan. That took a mind renewal. Things that you've succeeded at required you to make a decision and using the vegan, the being the plant-based diet, I decided I wanted to eat a plant-based diet. Well, that didn't immediately take out of my brain that I didn't like White Castles and I didn't like Kentucky Fried Chicken and prime rib and barbecue ribs. I mean, that I, I still, in fact, today, almost two years later, I still like that. So what I did for that mind renewal, which I, without realizing I was doing it, is I watched a ton of movies on YouTube, Netflix, Amazon, to educate myself on why a plant-based diet was better. I watched uh, some that showed from an environmental standpoint why it was better why it was better from an ethical standpoint of how the animals are treated and then the health reasons. So I was feeding my mind with all the positive reasons that I should go plant-based as well as the negative. So that when I saw my next prime rib or hamburger, I had enough information in my mind that I could resist. And the more, so I was taken, if you if you're my age, you remember old vinyl records. There are all these grooves, and each of your habits have a groove in your brain. And uh, it's simplistic, but the deeper that groove is, the harder it is to change that habit. So you have to build new grooves. So the more new grooves I built regarding why it would be good for me to be a plant-based diet and why it would be bad to eat meat or dairy and all of that, and continuing to tell myself that and continuing to talk to people, read books, watch TV videos about it, I was in essence digging a deep groove so that it made it easier for me to switch. The, it, they say it takes 21 days to make a new habit. Two of my daughters are joining me and we're going to be charting our our daily activity so that we can start building in new patterns of behavior and the thought process is a huge part of it your words speak it out loud tell someone so you have to decide if you want it and then at the end of the 21 days if you didn't do it or the New Year's resolution goes by or five years go by and you've not done it accept the responsibility just accept the fact that you didn't want it badly enough because it all comes down to how badly you want it. And we can all make excuses. Oh, I, I work or I have little kids or I don't have the money or whatever. But chances are, if you looked out in the world, there's people with the exact same circumstances and they were able to do it because they wanted it more than you did. So I challenge you or encourage you to look at your life and if there's something not working, then join us on day one to just make a change. You decide how big a change, you decide how many changes, um, but through the process, we're gonna be patting ourselves on the back and self-talk and telling yourself in the mirror. All of that, actually, it's easier for me to deepen my groove by looking in the mirror and saying how great my arms look or how great I'm doing in the exercise. That actually is going to be one of the easy things I can do every day to help me build my habit. And I know it sounds silly, but the proof of science is that telling yourself, 
thinking about it when you go to sleep. Plan the day, look at how your day went, plan your next day, think about how you're going to be exercising or eating differently or um, not picking up the cigarette or whatever habit it is you're trying to add or to break, think about it positively. Talk about it, say it out loud, think about it when you wake up in the morning, then it's going to be a great day and you're going to be very successful with it. And just do 21 days. There's so many things in life you've been successful at. Build on them. Just look, okay, I did that, I can do this. And Because it's all about whether you want to do it or not. So today's make a decision. Toss it out there, make a decision, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.